Is everything okay? Yeah. You don't look so good. Yeah, I'm all right. Where are you heading to? I don't know. Well, when this is all over, what are you going to do? Do you want to work for me? Well, I'll think about that. All right. Give me a call. Mom? Gary! Oh, Jesus Christ. This is good reading. Lots of action. A cop likes this kind of story. But the prosecutor, he's gonna love this. Oh, please, please, I, I didn't tell him anything. Adam, this is your signature. You told him everything. No, please, please, I, I didn't tell him anything. Haven't you figured it out yet, that there's no place to hide? This is the end of the line. Just tell us what you told them, and then we can help you. What's the deal, Alan? We trusted you, Alan. You betrayed us. You took all our money. Bargain with murderers. Give him some more. I think he likes it. Three point four million dollars. Papal thievery. With what case? All I see are these false accusations against my client. By no means are they false. I have my client's written and verbal testimony, and I will now ask Stefan to present some hard evidence. Stefan, if you will. As you can see, due to Mr. Lecoq's maltreatment, Stefan has endured serious injury. His right ankle was severely sprained, his left thumb was dislocated, and his buttocks were deeply bruised. Oh, I've had worse. Pansy! Mr. Bertelbaum, these injuries are no joke. Need I remind you that Mr. Lecoq is responsible for my client's grievances, and as the Lord is my witness, there will be criminal charges if no agreement is reached. A criminal charges? Preposterous. We have your signature on this here waiver, which states very clearly that as a mime of the Art Wankel Academy, you agree to improvise at the highest level, no matter how dangerous it may be. I had to jump down from a 17-foot building. Did you or did you not sign the waiver? Hmm. Then, without further ado, I believe this case is closed. Have you found a boat for us to steal? Pirate. I prefer the term pirate, which protects us under the civil ordinance. 17.068AZ3B. To answer your question, yes, I did. This way. There is never enough money for Patricia to live like the queen she thinks she is. I am torn between what the law tells me is right and what the book says about taking care of your loved ones. God created man in his own image. In the image of God, he created him. Male and female, he created them. Genesis chapter 1 verse 27.